Good morning guys, welcome back to today. Today is Sunday, another day off. How is Chino Bambino? Good. Better? Yeah. Better even than yesterday? Mm -hmm. He wants to get out and run around. All right, so probably tomorrow. Yeah. The vet said three days depending on how he is, so we're gonna see if he can hack it. Did you guys hand walk him? Yeah. yeah. What? Rolled. You hand walked him and he rolled and you didn't take the camera? So how was the hand walking? Good. Was he, he wanted to run. Was he kind of lameish on the front or no? No. I rolled and ripped the later up out of my hand. Guys. I rolled like a million times, like over and over and over. Oh, and the over poor boy. All right, so the swelling's like gone or almost gone? On the bottom part of the side, with the hand bone, it's almost completely gone, but the upper half, there's still a little bit more than at the joint there, like at his hawk is still swollen. Did you wrap it? That's where the infection got in. So we're gonna have to be careful about that. Maybe get some band-aids or something. Okay, so good morning. Welcome to today's video. Okay, so I've been posting a lot of TikToks. Wait, I used to have 4,000 followers. Now I have 5,129. Wow. I didn't notice that. Okay. Um, it's at Finn and Sophie. Okay, so if you guys want to hang with Soph, if you guys want to hang with the girls, talk to the girls, play games with the girls, Sophie's your best bet. Gabby doesn't do any of that stuff. She is not that kind of girl, but Sophie would be loving having friends online, huh? Yeah, I've been posting a lot of TikToks. She, who'd you play with last night? Elizabeth? Olivia. Olivia. She plays with, like, she's got a bunch of girls that she just hangs out with and FaceTimes with. I have three Olivias. Yeah. One I don't call with, the other two. One I've only called with once. Olivia and three Olivias, a Peyton, Elizabeth, I don't even know who else. So, follow Sophie on TikTok. Did you tell them your TikTok? Yeah. What was it again? Oh, so Sophie. Finn and Sophie. Wait, they can't see it. Oh, they still can't see it, but whatever. It's Finn and Sophie. At Finn and Sophie. A little Miss Daisy here, getting bigger and bigger, looking out the window, because that's her favorite thing on earth. She she runs upstairs onto my mom's bed when my mom leaves to go down to the barn and just looks out the window until you get back. Yeah, I love that about her. Okay, so before this video starts, I just want to tell you guys I got a message yesterday from somebody. It was not a hate message. It was nothing hateful. It was spoken in a kind way. But I wanted to share with you guys because I think this is something really important. It keeps on cropping up and I want to address it. So basically, this lady was just telling me that it's hurtful for us to show our haul videos and to show our Christmas hauls and stuff like that. And the reason it is hurtful is because other people can't always, not everybody can afford to spend that same amount of money that we spend on our kids. And that it makes people feel bad when they don't have what other people have. And so the reason I wanted to address this is because this keeps on popping up and there are some people that are totally, truly hurt by seeing the things that we buy and the things that we buy for our children. And I get it. I told the lady, there are many, many, many people in the world that have way more things than we do, buy way more things for their kids, spend way more money on their kids, And but I still get it. But here's the thing. This is what I believe, you guys. And the reason I'm telling you is because maybe it will help somebody out there. But basically, there are always gonna be people out there that have more than you, that are better than you at sports, that are prettier than you, that are thinner than you, that speak better than you, that have more friends than you, that like you name it, and there's always gonna be people that have more than you. For us, for everybody, like we, we're still like not even close to the top of what is possible out there in this world. And you can't change what people have. You can't change other people. All you can do is change how you react to other people and how you feel. So there's that, but also it's hurtful for some people to see what other people get. But for other people like me and my kids, we get motivation from seeing what other people buy. If somebody else buys something and it's amazing and it's something that speaks to me, then I will do whatever I can to get it. Like I will work harder. I will set goals to get the things that I see that other people have if it's something that's really important to me. But also, I like to see what other people buy because there are so many products out in the world and I don't know all of them and I like shopping through other people's shopping. That That's a fun thing for me and I know many of you guys like to do that as well. When we post haul videos, it's never to make anybody feel bad 
ever. And I understand that some people do struggle with feeling bad about seeing other people get stuff. That is a journey for you to go on. I've already gone through that journey. I don't want to go back there. I really like being in the place that I am at right now. And if talking about it helps any of you guys get past that and move on a little bit further in your journey, then I'm really excited to help you do that. And the other part that people don't talk about, and this is a big thing, is that YouTube is my job. This is me showing haul videos is a business decision. I don't go around in public and be like, oh yeah, like I bought a new saddle or like every Everybody look at all this stuff I bought like we just go to our barn and we're just our regular barn people I honestly truly believe who you are is what's important like we don't ever differentiate between how much stuff you have or the quality of the stuff you have like when we go to our barn who you are is who you are like I don't even I don't even notice other people's equipment unless it's something that I'm like wow that looks really good like unless it's something that somebody's using that change that could change our horse journey like some kind of equipment that is that could benefit us but yeah like for me what you have is not important so showing haul videos is a part of a business decision for me it's a business thing it's a, we work with a lot of advertisers we work with a lot of brands so this is a part of my business it's not something i go around doing in real life you guys know that i believe that we're all equal and what you buy has absolutely nothing to do with your self-worth at all what the heck are you doing <laughs> like, okay that break the ice okay. there so um my star stable surfer I'm on is Hazy Galaxy. Hazy Galaxy. For any of you guys who are worried that you have never been able to catch up with Sophie, she's on Hazy Galaxy. Anyway, let's start today's video. It. And thank you so much to the lady who sent me that message on Instagram because I did want to address it. I know it's been coming up since Christmas and whether or not you can agree with any of the things I said, just, just know that this is how I feel. This is our channel. I can only do what I feel is right for us at, at this time. Um, yeah. You guys ready to go to the barn? She can't eat poop or um, can't get hurt. Can't get hurt or eat poop, okay? You guys can do whatever you want. So uh, I'm going down to the barn and uh, Daisy's coming with me. Oh, it's not my favorite thing. I lost her already. Another gorgeous day on the day by day farm. Nothing better than sunshine in winter, you guys. See how, can you guys see how the snow is all glistening? It's super shiny. Sam just got back from getting hay. Hey, Penny Pickle. Hello. I got something super yummy for you today. And I have to give the ponies a treat too. And I need to clean the arena. All right, you want to see what I got? She's like, let's go. Let's go, Mama. Let's go for a walk. I stole these from the girls, so whoa, be grateful. I had to steal it to get it for you. What do you think? Hey, what do you think? So you guys talked me into it. You talked me into joining, joining the course. I joined a course. I joined a course. It was the girl that said, Laura, do it as a homeschool project. Like... Do it for homeschool because we have three horses at home. So basically, every week we're going to watch a video and get like the written work. And then the next week we will like have a group meeting kind of thing, all the people in the course, um, and we'll work on the thing. And this course is gonna teach us so much stuff. I, I know I, whoa. I know I've said it, I think she's eating poop. Don't eat poop. Don't eat poop. Oh, she's gonna poop. That's what she's gonna do. Come on, let's go outside and poop, Missy. Our puppies poop in the barn. It's so annoying. I believe in my journey with Penny is to show a different way with horses. That's what I honestly believe. I know nothing about horses. You guys know I came from being the non most non-horsey person of earth, never ever loving horses. And then now here I am getting ready to show horses in a whole different way. Like. God is good, you guys. He has a plan for everything. So this course is gonna allow me to learn and the girls to learn, so that's the whole thing. The girls don't know. I wish this dog would poop. So the thing, ah! Oops, so the thing that the girls don't know is that I'm going to be taking this course and they're gonna be taking this course with me. We're gonna be working on our ponies and our mares. They're gonna be able to take this training and use it with their boys and I'm hoping that what they learn in this course with the mares 
is going to convince them of, of how beneficial it is to really build a connection with your horse. So that's my goal. That is what I hope to do. I've seen those faces I've heard all the lies But you ain't gazing On someone in denial Cause you want dollar bills right now But you gotta work real hard So I think we're gonna be going back into lockdown Like major lockdown, we're in lockdown now, but it's gonna get even worse, like it was in the spring. And I think this course is really gonna be like something that we can do together while we're stuck at home doing like at home stuff. Basically, I'm working with a trainer right now, just for a short time, on my riding with Penny, like an online trainer that's specialized in gated, gated horses. And I'm gonna be doing like this Liberty, oh, natural Liberty stuff. So I want to clean the arena and I want to go out there and give the ponies a treat, but I have a puppy attached to me that is way harder to deal with right now. So the arena's going to have to wait till tomorrow. Good girl. It'd be nice to the ponies. Okay, it'd be nice to the ponies. I know you want it to be easy, so let your guard down. Sophie, every day you're gonna have to take your dog for did a she run. Eat poop? She did not eat poop. I'm pretty sure that's a lie. Pretty sure she did not eat poop. Anyways. So you were watching her. Well, anyways, she doesn't have hardly any muscle compared to the other dog. She needs to get out there and actually run every she day. Not as fast? No, she literally got winded and tired after like two seconds. So every day. She's a No, every day, five days a week at least, you need to take her out for a run. That's Almost a whole week. I know, it has to happen. Okay, so the whole house gets excited when a package okay. arrives. Sophie thinks it's for her. What's the name? Me. <laughs> it's for Sophie. We never get packages on Sunday, ever. That's so bizarre. We all want to see what it is, Sophie, all of us. What do you think it is? My poppet or? So you guys have been hearing her talk about these fidget well, toys. Said, I think it said that it's coming together, so I can use both of them. Oh, it's not my poppet, it's my. Marble meshes. It's super cool. There's a marble inside. And you There's a marble inside, and you just push it. Bike chains. Bike chains. Bike, bike chains. I don't know how you play with them, but like. Oh, cool. that's cool. Oh my gosh. Now that is enjoyable. It feels good. So it looks like this. I got two two monkey noodles. Two so monkey noodles. Oh, that'd be good for exercising. Oh, these feel good. I think these are wacky tracks. Wacky know. track, wacky tracks. I feel like we've had those before. Those aren't bad, actually. Oh, these are fun. A puzzle ball, which is really confusing. <laughs> yeah. Infinity cube. Oh my gosh, there's more. That's cool. Right, these are cool. These are pea poppers. It looks like peas. And oh, that feels good. <laughs> it has a face. Look, Mom, it has a face. It does have a face. The Super other, cute. The other two don't. Okay. The most thing excited about. Last thing she's the most excited about is it's called a cube. Jack would like these. Wait, what's on the other side? Like a remote. So these are all her homemade fidgets. Well, some of them are not homemade. She's got these things. Adding my fidgets. And these. Oh, these are my monkey noodles. And these are the real ones. Her fake monkey noodles are balloons. <laughs> and these are real monkey noodles. Something 
knocked you out You felt your limitations And filled your mind with doubt You wanna stay chill right now And don't let your eyes off the prize I know you want it to be easy So let your guard down And I said See it in your mind Trust that Have what it takes inside Cause you can make it too Now, did you hear her snorting? Nope. And I said We have to do some new stuff with Chino. We're taking off the top dressing, maybe doing a little walk around the arena, which I think I'll do while the girls get ready. Can't ride tomorrow because the arena is already booked and I was late booking it this, this week. So we're gonna ride tonight. The girls are gonna ride tonight and then we'll go back to our regularly scheduled program. Hi, Bambi. Yeah, can you just come with me? Oh, yeah. look, he drops his, hey, hello. Well, can you just come with me? Chino, your stall smells. All right, fine. I'll come with you. I'll be right back. I'm gonna take you. For, look at those eyes. I'm gonna take you for a walk. Yeah, I'm just gonna uh, let him go. Taking the dressings off now because now we're gonna get him. The infection's getting really good, so we're gonna just let him. He's allowed to walk around alone. He's allowed to walk around in the arena all by himself. Just can't chase him. Oh, he's calling. He'll probably be out by Tuesday. He's kicking and that is annoying. Anyway, the girls want me to go with them for a walk. Oh, I'm frozen yeah. though. I'm still frozen from that's, my ride. That's why you walk. But I loved my ride. Like, turning into a horse woman, you guys. I Do you know what I did last night? I don't even see Finn. Do you know what I did last night? Last night, I spent hours watching horse riding videos, horse training videos. I spent hours watching horse, you like. I signed up for a lot of, I, like, yeah, like, never before in my life would I ever watch a horse training video, ever. Like, I would never. Even the girls don't really watch a lot of horse training you videos. Have to go off. Oh, I see Finn. He's with, he's with right. two other horses. It's almost supper time for the horses, so. He's with two other horses, Mom. Yeah. Don't even think about it, dude. No, 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 no. And don't take me for a run. Nice try, though. Oh, you could just jump on him and go galloping. Or I would love that. that. Oh, I do that too. Uh oh. He's making a break for it. I see it. Gabby, put your hand out. Pretend you have a treat. Oh, she won't do that because uh, how dare him run up from her. That's so stupid. It's just I'm running back here. Yeah. All right. Come here. <laughs> Come here. Come here, she says. Huh. Long walk. 
Oh gosh. Is that Oakley? Yeah. Yellow. Oakley's lazy, I think. Yeah. Which is nice. Uh oh, what happened? Oh my god, they're playing. Oh. Walk it's not way. time for playing, dude. It's time for working. Oh, I'll block it. I can get there before he can get to me, trust me. Hurry, we gotta, we're got running out of time. Look, you lost your horse, he's gone. She left the wrong person to stand at the exit because let me tell you, if they run at me, I'm just stepping aside. Like, I'm not an idiot. I do not have a death wish. All right, we should see them flushed out in a minute. Look at how good they are. They hid behind the hill. Like, nobody can find them. They think if we can't see them, we can't catch them. Hopefully she finds them. I'm waiting for them to burst out. Oh, there they go. That horse doesn't even belong in the field. Oh my God, they're coming for me. Don't! Stop! 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 All of you stop. I will shake my arms. Don't do it. Alright, you guys can go. You're free to go. You're free to go. I got you. <laughs> huh. So that other horse that's here, he's not even in this field. He just keeps hopping the fence. Get off of me, Oakley. I do not want any funny business. No funny business. I was brave. Wasn't I brave? Well, that was scary. Yeah, I'm standing in the middle of four horses. Yep, bravely I am. Do not even think about it. He's gonna try and make a run for it. All right, you are caught and I saved the day. Did you see me? <laughs> that was scary as heck. I was literally standing here. That's gonna be the best footage of life. Like that was beautiful. Them all running to me. I don't know how shaky the camera was though. But yeah, like Penny's making me brave, you guys. Next time, just jump on them and ride them back. Bring your helmet. Bring your helmet next time. It takes too long for me to put on my helmet. I just hurt my knee. I would love to ride Penny in these woods. Like there's lots of little tiny obstacles to step over. But I think she could do it. I think I could do it. And then there's nice paths. I think I should do it. He is looking really good, you guys. A little bit of swelling around. A little bit of stiffness, too. Storm and Finn do not need to have other horses around for company. They're they're all okay with just having us. 
they recognize it's a part of their herd. I wonder if that's part of Chino's problem. Aww. They're all there to say hi. Don't you know that you're beautiful?